Let's talk brake chambers. This is a type 3030 parking brake chamber. It has two 30 square inch diaphragms inside and is mounted to a Bendix air disc brake. You've got the service brake diaphragm towards the wheel here, the parking diaphragm on the back, and the caging bolt lives right here. If you need to cage your brakes, you install the caging bolt through the rear cover and make sure it locks into these tabs here by twisting it to the right. We'll put the cover back on and talk about air leaks. If you ever hear air coming from this area, or here with the parking brake released, the parking diaphragm is leaking and the chamber must be replaced. Air heard at the front with the service brake supplied means the front diaphragm is leaking. Brake chamber will have to be replaced for this as well. The chamber is labeled on the side so you can tell which section you're dealing with. If you have a leak in a line, the fittings are also offset so you can tell which one is which. Properly functioning brake chambers keep us all safe on the road. Like and subscribe for more truck stuff.